few years ago, we really did not have many opportunities when it came to medical services. That's all changing. Buda is getting its first full service hospital just three months after getting a medical center. Baylor Scott and White will hold its grand opening tomorrow. It's welcome news for a lot of people there. Hospital providers are targeting Buda because of one big reason it has to do with how fast the city is growing. Candy Rodriguez is live this morning from inside Candy, the state of the art facility, for a first look at what we could expect. Good morning. Sally and Amanda, good morning. Yes, doors open tomorrow here at the hospital in Buda. And right now we're upstairs inside one of the patient rooms. And this hospital is coming to a growing area. In just nine years, the population of Buda has more than doubled, going from 7,500 in 2010 to more than 16,000 as of the latest census. Baylor Scott and White says the new hospital will offer more than 15 specialties, primary care, an emergency room, general surgery, plus things like cardiology and orthopedics. City officials say this will help those seeking medical attention in the area. Especially if you're in pain or you're not feeling well, nobody wants to sit in traffic that long. The great thing about this site is that we have 26 acres and we're positioned to grow uh, with the community. Um, and we'll, uh, we're excited uh, to have that flexibility and, and uh, potential. Again, doors open tomorrow to the hospital and the emergency room. We're live in Buda this morning. Candy Rodriguez, KXAN News. When it comes to larger medical providers, Baylor Scott & White is not alone. In June, Ascension Seton cut the ribbon on its new medical care option in Buda. The Seton Center also has 15 specialists and is across the street from the new hospital. Both hospital providers say they see a need for care because of the growth in the area. Last year's census numbers show Hayes County had the second highest percentage of growth since the start of the decade. Today